In this video, I'm going to decorate this fun little statue. Go! Hey, Marieke Blokland here from Bloknoot.nl. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Hey everyone, Marieke Blokland here from Bloknoot.nl. In this video, I am going to show you how I paint this statue from Wagner. Uh, I'm planning of making the hair black and then the face a bit grey and tiny little red symbols on his face and the rest I'm not sure yet. Maybe I'm going to give him some clothes or something. Um, yeah, just make a fun item for my home. Block note style, of course. <laughs> In this art DOI I'm going to uh, decorate this thrift store find. It is a little statue of Wagner and it uh, is some kind of um, fake porcelain material. I don't really know what it is. It's just some weird thing that, that I got for one euro. And uh, I'm going to alter it in the block note style. I cleaned it very well and I'm first going to add a layer of white gesso and then next I'm going to pimp it with acrylic paints. little statue of Wagner and that I forgot to film the rest. <laughs> All of a sudden I was like, ah, oh, this is finished. And then I looked up and I thought, oh, I didn't film the rest. 
So I'm just going to talk um, to the camera what I did as the last few steps. I um, applied a layer of clear gesso and then I added some paint drops with watercolors, which is really weird. I would never advise this um, to do on objects that you um, really want to use. Um, I noticed that this little thing is probably from a type of plastic and the the paint was already peeling off a little bit here on the top so it's probably really fragile um, but I really wanted to do this I don't know for for how long this will last but um, for now it looks really fun I allow will allow this to dry for a day and then I will spray uh, a matte varnish on it I am using this uh, acrylic varnish by Amsterdam uh, matte which um, will give a very pretty matte layer to your work um, so this is to protect uh, it from um, yeah from dirt but um, yeah because this material is not really meant to be painted I don't know for how long this will last but uh, I really like the end result so uh, I hope that you like this video even though I forgot to uh, film that one tiny last step I quickly want to show you the technique that I used on the doll I added a layer of clear gesso that is a product that I often use in my art journals and it is a transparent base coat uh, it has a bit of a grainy um, feel and then I applied a layer of this lunar black uh, watercolors um, I often do this in my art journals as well this is how it looks uh, on simple paper and I often use uh, a bit of a um, sloppy uh, technique for this with a lot of um, water and blotches and I allow it to dry very um, wet and blotchy um, I will see you again in the next art DIY video thank you so much for watching and if you make anything um, arty uh, I'm really curious so please do comment with a link to your work I would love to see it and um, give me a thumbs up if you uh, want more of this type of art DIYs ciao that's it thank you so much for watching this video you rock <laughs> please support me by liking this video and subscribe for more quirky art inspiration and raw self-expression ciao